How's it going everybody? Thanks for tuning in. This is gonna be a quick one, a little different format. So the other day I did a video where I was showing off my shelves and I mentioned that I hate tapes and uh, what kind of tapes I had. And a couple of people showed some interest and were like, dude, I want those tapes. So uh, I picked out a bunch of tapes here that you're welcome to buy from me. You can make me an offer or something. I don't really know how to do it, but I imagine this could go well. Uh, if you want, we can sell it through Discogs or eBay or something. Uh, I'll take PayPal, you know, as long as I get a couple of bucks for these. None of these are, as far as I know, all that rare. They're just like old 80s, 90s versions of pretty big, you know, thrash, death uh, albums and stuff. Plus, they were all in my car for months at a time, so they're not in any sort of great condition or anything. But if they're going to go to a good home, that'd be great. Uh, and if I can make a couple of bucks, I'm gonna buy me a, a slice of pizza for it. That'd be great in the process. Uh, while I talk about this, we're gonna be listening to uh, an old Volfana demo. So uh, I'll just go through this as quick as I can, I suppose. This is The Accused. Their album is called Splatter Rock. Uh, this has probably only been played a few times. I found this sealed somewhere. It's in great shape. Uh, it's kind of like a punky thrash band. Classic Doom album, Anathema, Serenades. This is on Peaceville Futurist. It also has the uh, Crestfallen EP, I believe. As bonus tracks, just like the CD version. Here is Atrocities, Hallucinations. Uh, this is a Road Racer version. Uh, let me make sure it's in there. Yeah, on Nuclear Blast. Next, we've got Autopsies, Sever Severed Survival, plus Retribution for the Dead. Also on Peaceville Futurist. Uh, yeah. Next, we've got Cannibal Corpse Eaten Back to Life and Cannibal Corpse Censored version of The Bleeding. Uh, yeah. By no means do I hate any of these albums or bands or anything. I just have very little use for the cassette format these days. Next, we've got, uh, might as well go this way. Censored versions of Rika Peter Faction and Tools of the Trade by Carcass, both on Earache, with unfortunate shit ass artwork that they wouldn't let us stomach back in the 90s. And then we've got Necroticism. This album got a hell of a lot of play my uh, first year in college. This is Carnage Dark Recollections on Earache, 1990. Killer, underrated thrash album. This is Cyclone Temples. I hate, therefore I am. On combat, need to pick this up on LP. Next couple of death albums: Symbolic, Individual Thought Patterns, some of their best material. Uh, yeah, love that band. Stay in there. We're going alphabetical too, by the way. You're welcome. Uh, DBC Universe, Killer Thrash Band. Uh, Deicide's Legion, this is the Road Racer version. Uh, Dismember, Indecent and Obscene, Nuclear Blast. Dismember, Like an Everflowing Stream, Nuclear Blast. This is probably my all-time favorite record. Uh, this tape has been played a hell of a lot of times, but it still has a hell of a lot more plays in it. Those sections, Storm of the Light's Bane. Come on, you've already got that. Exit 13, uh, Don't Spare the Green Love, I don't know what's with that band. Fear Factory, Soul of a New Machine, one of my earliest favorite metal albums. Halloween, Keeper of the Seven Keys, Part 2. This is actually a recent acquisition, Intolitarian, um, this was given to me, this is like a demo. This is given to me by Kramer, uh, we all know that guy. Creator, Pleasure to Kill. Meat Hook Seed, Embedded. This is a great project by members of Napalm Death. You should check that out. Sounds lo nothing like Napalm Death, which is why I like it. Uh, Meshuggah, Destroy, Race, Improve. Uh, here's a version of Morbid Angel's Altars of Madness that has had tons of cologne uh, spilled all over it. It wasn't my cologne. I fucking hate the stuff, but some asshole spilled cologne in my car all over my Morbid Angel tape. So take this home with you tonight. Morgoth, Cursed, Killer Death Metal Album. 
Uh, Mutilation, I believe this is self-titled, not the Mutilation that we all uh, talk about. This is with one eye. This is on JL America, generic death metal. A couple albums from Omen, Warning of Danger, and The Curse, killer early power metal from the 80s. Possessed Seven Churches. This is the 1999 Relativity version on tape, so not by any means an original. This is Pungent Stench's Dirty Rhymes and Psychotronic Beats on Nuclear Blast. Next we've got kind of a rarity. Uh, this is Sarcophago's Rotting EP on Kogumelo, uh, released by Maze in 91. Still sealed. I found this at a grocery store when I was picking up uh, milk and eggs. Or let's be honest, cookies and pizza. Yeah. Sinisters Cross the Sticks. Tankards, The Morning After, one of my favorite thrash metal records. Uh, this is a compilation put out by Roadrunner, I wanna say. Yeah, Roadrunner, uh, called At Death's Door 2, and it's got uh, Fear Factory, Disincarnate, Suffocation, Cynic, Gorguts, Death, Malevolent Creation, Atrocity, Brujeria, Immolation, and Skin Chamber on it. Pretty cool road trip mix, if you still got a car with a tape player. You got Violence, Eternal Nightmare, never really cared for that band. Uh, Voivod's Angel Rot, Voivod's Nothing Face. And a weird reissue of Watain's Rabid Death's Curse, which is on a Thailand label called In Coffin, who are known for reissuing a bunch of black metal stuff on cassette. So that's it. That's all I've got for sale and cassettes. So, like I said, just get a hold of me through YouTube or whatever, Facebook, if we're friends on there. Uh, we'll hook up a sale through PayPal. Or if you want to do it uh, hoity-toity through Discogs or eBay or whatever, we can work something out. Yeah, see you later.